How's it going, everybody? Frankie Slauson here. <clears throat> oh, kind of warm with the vehicle today. Oh, very warm. So never leave, the, never have it on the heater mode when it's summertime. Even though it's kind of cold around here, sometimes in the morning, it gets hot in here in the afternoon. Oh, that was my mistake. Oh, well, well, well. Had some Snapple. Had to have some Snapple. Just got done drinking this. It's actually very, very good stuff. Oh, well. Oh, gotta roll up the window, too. Well, roll up the window, because it's like I tell you, remember, I don't like it when so many people, you know, watch me vlog or hear me vlog or whatever when I'm doing it live or whatever, because, you know, I'm kind of still getting used to doing this every day. And today, being the first day of summer officially, and the longest day of the year, well, I don't know. I'm still getting, I'm still trying to get used to this anyway. I'm, not that I'm embarrassed if somebody sees me uh, talking on the, talking to the camera here, but they're probably wondering, you know, what the hell is, who the hell is he talking to? And then I tell that guy or girl, I'd say, I'm talking to you if you go on YouTube and you watch my video. I'm talking to you, but I'm over here and you're way over there. And you know, you're you know a few cars uh, uh, by me or whatever, and <laughs> but I'm technically talking to you, but yet I'm not looking at you, although I'm looking at you right now. Yeah, anyway. Okay. Well, in today's video, if you remember yesterday's video, I was talking about, or to, I was gonna say that I was gonna talk about my favorite YouTubers, and I am gonna talk about my favorite YouTubers today. And reasons why I like these YouTubers, or why I enjoy these YouTubers, and uh, well, let's start, huh? <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just kind of a boring intro. Uh, I'm just kind of I'm not tired because I actually you know work worked a pretty good worked a pretty good schedule today, but just bored, you know, just bored. I'd rather be at home playing with my my new nephew, you know. Sorry, still still have a little bit baby envy, and I will have that for a long time. I try not to mention about it every day, but you know it's kind of hard not to. I'll get over it after a while. <laughs> All right, my favorite YouTubers, and we're gonna start off with two guys who actually three guys who I who were pretty much to me the founding fathers of why YouTube is successful, why YouTube is why it is, and why these guys to me are legends and heroes and. I'm talking about Cool Duder, MJ Kelly Zero. Well, I'll just go by the usernames anyway. Cool Duder, MJ Kelly Zero, and Dweebo1234. Okay, Cool Duder. Well, everybody knows Cool Duder. His name, Sean C. Phillips. And why Why do I like him? Why, why, why do, what makes me keep coming to watch every video that he puts up, whether it's a Round the Town video, whether it's a DVD update, whether it's just him talking about that he, you know, got a, uh, a new movie role or something. It's because he, he reminds me so much of me, you know, at a younger age, okay? Mind you that I'm only maybe a year, year and a half to almost two years. Yeah, about two, I guess, two years and I think two years and older than him, I think, because he's born September, September 23rd, I believe, 1985, I was born September 30th, 1983, so two years and, and maybe a week apart, something like that, anyway, but the fact that he loves the 80s and loves the 90s and, and, and maybe even now, even the 2000s a little bit, you know, uh, and the fact that he, you know, his family, you know, has been able to do so much. And I find it surprising, you know, that the famous basement, you know, at his house will no longer be, it'll be it's going to be somebody else's basement. Somebody else is going to have the thrill of a lifetime, if they're a collector, that is, to have a very nice basement in that house where they can have everything they want, you know, where they can, you know, collect DVDs, toys, whatever. But I guarantee probably the people who are probably, you know, buying the uh the house or whatever probably aren't as uh, gonna be as fun or as cool as the Phillips family as I like to call them as that's their last name anyway uh 
you know, and, and and that's also what keeps me coming to to Sean Sean's videos because not just the love of the '80s and '90s, but his friend MJ Kelly, who I'm bringing up, and that and him, you know, have, are guys who should be doing films that are more mainstream, like blockbusters. I mean, I think they'd be able to do it. I think if they were asked even to do a voiceover for like a cartoon show or it's just, or like an animated show or whatever that's on, you know, like by Disney or something, I think they could do it. I really think they could. But why they haven't got offers yet for that, I have no idea. You know, it's great to do independent stuff here and there, but if you really want to make an impact, if you really want to, you know, where you actually get a chance to experience what you've always wanted to experience and you get to work with people who you've always dreamed of working with, I think it's the best thing to do is to uh, do it, you know, just do it the way that you were taught. I mean, do it, you know, move away from independence here or there, or do it once in a while, independence here or there, but try to go for that big role. Cause I would love to see one day that see Sean and MJ together doing maybe the next Batman film or, or, or we take a role in Ghostbusters 3 or something. I don't know. Just something, something cool, you know, and I hope maybe in the next five, ten years we see that. And I know there's a lot of people that agree with me. Uh, another guy, Dweebo1234, which is his real name, Ethan Phillips. Uh, you know, he, he's, he, he 